Hello, my peeps, and welcome to another wonderful podcast. Today's podcast is going to be on how to use Khan Academy. So as I said in the song, why don't you take a little trip with me, and let's talk about the Khan Academy for a few minutes today. The first question you're probably asking yourself is, why would Mr. Phillips want me to do the Khan Academy? He just wants to punish me, that evil math teacher. <laughs> Contrary to popular belief, I am not asking you to do Khan Academy to punish you. I like to think of math as a road. Unfortunately, sometimes in life, roads develop potholes. And it's not very fun to drive down a road full of potholes. Well, we need construction crews to come in and put pavement back in those potholes to smooth them out so the root road excuse me so the road becomes a little smoother it's the same thing in math with the Khan Academy for whatever reason sometimes math becomes hard to some of us because we've have developed potholes in our math skills we've forgotten how to do some things there's some things we don't know how to do and then those potholes keep us from being successful in math so Khan Academy is like the construction workers. Khan Academy will help you fill in those potholes, fill in those gaps, skills for things that you don't understand or you've forgotten in math to help you be successful. There are a few ways that you can get to the Khan Academy. You can use the web address that's on your sticker it's also the web address here on the screen or the easiest way is probably just to go to the Veterans Park Academy for the Arts number one school in the East Zone baby and when you go to the VPA website down in the bottom left hand corner there is a quick link that you can click on for Khan Academy and then you can just bookmark it and yes Khan Academy has been Chuck Norris approved All right, so let's go ahead and go into Khan Academy to show you what it looks like. When you log into Khan Academy, you will see gray boxes going across the top. These are all different math skills. Notice that all the boxes are gray. That's because I have not practiced any yet. As I practice them and get better at them, they will turn blue. They'll turn to a light blue and then a medium blue and a darker blue. The darker the color, the better you are at that skill. So once we've done the pretest, which we're gonna go through here in a second, some of these gray boxes will start turning blue. You want them to turn dark blue because that means you know how to do that concept. So once you've logged into Khan Academy, the first thing I'm gonna ask you to do is start the pretest. So we're gonna go through the pretest. You can read the tutorial once you do it yourself. Keep in mind, if you get the questions right, it's going to give you harder questions. If you start getting questions wrong, it's going to make the questions easier. So it's going to adapt to how you're doing. If there's something that you have not done before, it's okay. You can just click on, I haven't learned this yet. So I'm just going to put in some answers. Some of them I'll get right, some of them I won't get right. Now it's going to go back and check my answers. It's going to give me some points for what I got right. 
I'm going to close this screen. Now there's a couple different things I can do. I finish the pretest. That's the first thing you should do. If your teacher, that would be me, <laughs> recommended by Brian Phillips, has recommended things for you to do, you can work on the things that he has recommended to do. If you don't want to do that, then there's all kinds of things down here that you can work on. So I'm just going to go in here and I'm going to work on what the teacher has recommended for me. Notice that you're asked to get five correct in a row. When you get five correct in a row, that tells the computer that you know how to do that skill. So I can work the problem. If I need a hint, I can click here. I'd like a hint. If I'm completely stuck, Khan Academy will link videos to the skill that you're working on. You can click down here to watch the video. I just want to show you one more screen here on the Khan Academy we talked about earlier. This is a different account I logged into so you can see. You can see that some of these boxes up here are shaded in blue. Light blue means I kind of know how to do it. Darker blue means I feel pretty good about it. The darkest blue means I have mastered it. So as you work through Khan Academy, you want these boxes up here to turn blue. Again, you can see where the crazy math teacher has assigned you specific concept skills to work on. In this case, it would be multi-step equations with the distributed property. Or, if you don't want to work on that, there's also other things that you can work on down here. The more problems you get right in Khan Academy, the more points you get. The more problems you get right, the more points you get. So let's talk about those points. I will, in my infinite wisdom, power, and knowledge, give you extra credit for the second quarter. I'll give you extra credit for the second quarter for doing Khan Academy. Remember, you need to get the problems right to get points. I'll make a column here in the gradebook. It'll be like a savings account or a bank, and I'll just put extra credit points in there for if you work Khan Academy and you earn points in the Khan Academy. I'll then take these extra credit points and add them to your lowest quiz or test grade. You can work on Khan Academy before school. You can work on it during class if you're caught up during your podcasts. You can work on it after school in my room, Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays. If you have internet at home, you can work on it at home. You can work on it at the public library. They have free internet. So there's lots of different times that you can work on the Khan Academy if you want to earn extra credit. Because we do not want this to happen to you on the EOC. Don't let that happen to you on the EOC. And don't let this happen to you on the EOC. Now, that would not be good. But by working on the Khan Academy, it will help you be like, like a champion. I know. I hate saying this. Sorry, I had to drink a little bit of hate right here. It will let you be like the Miami Heat because we want you to score a 399 or higher on the EOC. All right, if you have any questions about the Khan Academy, let me know. Thanks for watching, guys.